Well, good evening, little girl. You ready to go on date night? Yeah. Yeah, you're gonna have some fun. We are just gearing up for date night right now. I'm gonna go to the super romantic grocery store known as Giant Eagle. Sushi night at Giant Eagle. And we both haven't had sushi in a while. And sushi's pretty good for my diet. So, yeah, you guys get it. Diet update, I've lost 11 pounds. Feeling pretty good. Like, still, I, and this is nothing new. Hungry all the time, but it's effective, it's working, so gotta stick with it. Gotta be more healthy for you, little girl. Yeah, you agree? Right now, we are just waiting for Booker to come so he can babysit. Such a good babysitting friend. Well, our third wheel isn't too happy. I mean, she didn't have to come, but leaving her with Booker would be a bad idea. This, he doesn't deserve this. So it looks like we'll probably get our sushi, eat real fast, then go home. What do you think? Yes. Because it's carving pumpkins night, right? Last year I did better, right? If I remember correctly. We can go to the vlog, but I'm pretty sure I did okay back then. It was cute watching Christopher. Oh, yeah, yeah. Did you watch it recently? Uh, a few months ago. You're like the vlog historian. Mm -hmm. I rarely watch the old ones, which I should. I have before, but it's been a while. Do you know what kind of sushi you're going to get? Well, are they all five dollars? There's a uh, select. I don't know what the select ones are. Uh, Sushi night's cheap though, so that's cool. So maybe we can get three and split them. Ooh, I or like it. Four. <gasps> what? Born. You are crazy. Gotta give a special shout out to my wife. She dealt with some fussy kids today. I come home, both kids, well actually Emma was eating so she wasn't screaming, but Christopher, I have not seen him that much of a mess for a long time. I feel like it's been a long time. I mean, maybe you would see it more than I do, but can the you? Little girl was angry. Right, she was screaming before she I got home. Said, Here you go. <laughs> yeah. So you moms out there, or you dads who stay home, you guys, you guys rock that. You keep the house strong by staying strong. You want some sushi, little girl? Yeah. I don't think you'd like it, and it's not good for you. So what we get, Lauren? I don't even know. What you picked them? I know one has eel, one has salmon and tuna. It looks pretty darn good, guys. I am a big sushi fan. Most Asian food I'm, I'm a fan of. I can't really think of one. You know, I've never had like the raw octopus of Korea. Would you eat that, Lauren? That thing that moves? Yeah. No. <laughs> that thing that moves. Most things move. No, no, I'm serious. I know, it's alive. It's alive. I don't think I could do it. It's I think there's one that you eat raw and it's alive. Something about their muscles. Yeah, I know that one too. I could probably eat that. I don't know. Maybe I couldn't. Could you eat that? Okay. Well, we're gonna have some din din. How are you doing? Great. Great. Yeah. How are the kids? That's good. John and I will be releasing a full-length feature film. Oh yes. Booker wants to make a movie. You guys think Booker and I should make a movie together? Yeah, it's about life. <laughs> He's right. We're going upstairs to play. John doesn't let them play upstairs when I'm not here. Why? Yeah, I don't. Because I'm responsible. It is actually the smart choice. Christopher hasn't really mastered his knife juggling yet. You guys playing with the tiger? You got that? You okay, buddy? Hey, what's wrong? What's wrong? Mama. Mommy's putting little girl to bed. Mama. You should probably do one at a time. Yeah. What's that? That's a Superman chair bed. You remember those things when we were kids? Not the Superman version, but like. Drape? <laughs> no. No. What do you got there? Did you get a vest? Yeah, we, he found a gun. You don't have gun toys? <laughs> oh, he has like a laser gun, I guess. Oh. Lightsabers, though. You want to play lightsabers? I want to play lightsabers. That's a. That's not a chicken. That's a dragon. No, Here, I got something dragon. for your comments. Why don't you guys tell us something fun? <laughs> Booker says, "Tell us something fun in the comments." Yeah. Eliana, what do you want the comments to say? Nothing. Keep it friendly. <laughs> what are you thinking, Christopher? What are you doing? Are oh, you wrestling the tiger? Sam, you are a, you're a firecracker. Oh, he's getting Darth Vader's. Don't hit people, Sam. Oh, he uses it like Chris used to. <laughs> Uh-oh. He's the Jedi who holds it blade first. <laughs> uh -oh. <laughs> he's that good with the force. Yeah, that's risky. You want to jump, Chris? Criss Cross will make you jump, jump. Are you familiar with Criss Cross, Chris? Oh, look out, look out. 
Ooh, that was close. Are you familiar <laughs> with Chris Christopherson, Chris? You know a lot of Chris's. Yeah. <laughs> well, get out of my house. All right, so it is pumpkin carving time, and we got this set at Michael's last week and to let Christopher decorate one. We thought He's, it was stickers. But it's more like... It's wood. Yeah, it's going to be high quality. We can use over and over again. And it helps because he doesn't have to touch a knife. Do you like it? Yeah. That's awesome. And this little girl doesn't like sleep. She was fussy like she was tired and then didn't go to sleep. <laughs> yeah, it's, it's super funny. It's really funny. <laughs> Barrel's pumpkin's certainly coming along. One more thing to put in, the witch's hat. Are you ready? Yeah. Lauren and I had a debate on how to do a pumpkin with the bat signal and I think we both wanted, we're talking about like different kind of designs and I just realized both of ours would work. So there was no reason to fight, Lauren. Mm. Whose was better though? I'm focusing right now. Oh, that means mine. That means she doesn't want to admit it on camera. Are you ever going to go to sleep? Little girl. <laughs> Sleep sack like a little burrito. You should have been a Chipotle burrito. I know it's been done, but it's funny. Do you want to carve a pumpkin, Ike? Is that why you're right in the middle of all this? Oh, buddy, how you doing? How about on this pumpkin? We're going to carve that. We're carving that pumpkin, buddy. Uh, what do you think of the witch? Do you like the pumpkin witch? I really hate all the pumpkin guts and stuff like that, but Lauren wants to make it a sensory bin thing for Christopher. Sensory bag. Sensory bag, whatever. And then with all the guts. So. But I do like eating the seeds, so that's worth it. What's in the pumpkin barrel? Uh, seeds. Yep, there's a bunch of seeds and guts. It does look pretty graphic from like, just if you were just in here there's zoomed in. It's, you think it's dirty? There, there's some dirt. Is it a dirty pumpkin? I don't, I think it's just guts and seeds, dude. It's guts. Yeah. You want to touch them? <laughs> Do you like that? Yes. Wow, cool. Good talk. Well, Daddy forgot what time it was. We don't have time to try our Batman experiment. But we're going to carve a face into it, okay? Does that sound good? Oh, look at you helping. You can put that there now. I think that's the right. Um, get some more. Get some more. Oh, Hold on. That's we gotta carve it now. I don't. There we go. It fits. Look, fits perfectly. I'm a good person. All right. So the eyes and the nose are pretty good, but now we're on in the mouth. Am I gonna do a good job? What do you think? All right. Here's our sensory pumpkin. Oh, you want to show the sensory pumpkin? Wonderful. <laughs> he loves it. All right. I finished the mouth. Time to press it out and see if I did a good job. The mouth is always the hardest part. Oh. How'd I do? I can't even see it. He looks good. We just got to clear some guts. <laughs> nice! Teeth and everything. Alright. A little misshapen, but not bad without a stencil. Like you like it? Alright, I'll let Mommy do the finer stuff. So Mommy is doing the finer touches on the guts coming out of the mouth. But I think I did alright. Yeah? You think I did good? Great. So, hopefully I didn't displease her. If you guys remember my first vlog where we cut and pop, we cut because <laughs> I made a lot of mistakes. But you're not one of them. You're my favorite pumpkin. Right, she loved that. You know, it doesn't look too bad, Lauren. I got a nice big center tooth in the bottom, which I'm not good at bottom teeth. Do you like it, Christopher? Yeah, the hit of approval. <laughs> Do you like it, Christopher? Emma hates it. Are you finally ready for bed, little girl? Are you gonna go to sleep finally? Yeah? It's okay, Barrel. It's just pumpkin guts. Pumpkin guts. It's the only time saying, oh, it's just guts. It's okay. There are our pumpkins. I have to say, while I, that one, like, good classic, I do really like not just the easy aspect, but how cool it looks. What do you think, Barrel? Which one's your favorite? I want to put them in my upstairs. You want to put them in your bed upstairs? Yes. No, you can't sleep with a pumpkin. Uh, upstairs. Barrel, you might, it might get hurt in the middle of the night. No, 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 no. But you, pumpkins are for outside. Chris. Oh, oh, you love pumpkins? Oh, that's nice. We're, we'll leave them here for you before we go to bed. It's almost bedtime. It's almost bedtime. 
Well, I just put Christopher down. It was really hard. He is having nightmares right now, specifically about Pennywise the Clown. So that's great. Thank you, Stephen King. Not the new one, though. He's actually scared of the old one because we went to a trick-or-treat thing that had an animatronic thing, and they're like, oh, check out this button. What happens when I push it? And it goes, I'll kill you all. And you're like, okay, relax. You just, you really feel sad for your kid, like, to see them afraid like that. So do your best, and I think he's asleep now, so that's great. But anyways, Lauren and I rented the movie The House with Will Ferrell and Amy Poehler, and I heard mixed reviews, but Lauren and I don't care. We just want a nice comedy. And Lauren's making the pumpkin seeds, which are actually a healthy snack for me, as long as I don't throw too much goodness. What'd you season them with? Butter. Butter and what? Salt. Okay. I can handle a little butter. It's, it's the sugar I gotta stay away from. Just finished the house. I thought it was pretty funny. I really did. I thought there were some really good jokes, some running jokes, and uh, great dialogue, of course. I think it deserved more praise than it got. I mean, it wasn't like the best comedy last year, but I thought it was a solid movie. Great cast and uh, great writing. I did not recognize the writer's names. So I should probably look them up, see what else they've done. As I've gotten older in my movie critiquing, I've looked more at writers and directors than I have at actors because I feel like they don't get enough credit. I mean, obviously they get paid and whatnot, but I don't think they get enough credit for the creative aspect, so. Anyways, that is gonna do it for us tonight, guys. Thanks so much for watching. Had a great time doing some pumpkin stuff, being with Christopher during a scary time for him, and just having some sushi. I know I didn't film a ton at this at the sushi place, aka the grocery store, but that's because we had to hold Emma. Emma Emma likes to be held. She does not like to be sitting, so maybe that means she'll be a very active kid. Or maybe that just means I'll be holding her till she's forty. Anyways, we got a fun little weekend planned for you. Well, it's planned for me. You guys can watch it. You don't know what the plan It's a surprise! <laughs> no, I'm going to the OSU football game against Penn State, and we also have, like, a birthday party, and I don't know. You'll see. I'll figure it out, and we'll, it'll be fine. And fun. Anyways, we will see you next time, and whatever, dude.